Good morning, Incans, immigrants, natives, citizens around the world, no matter what nation you're in. It's time to eat what we grow. And I want to relieve my tomato tree of this tomato so that she can continue to get the others ripened. So I'm going to cut her off. I only have one hand. I don't have anyone to do camera today. So you're going to have to excuse me while I cut her. Like this here. Here is her design. You got to make sure you know how to cut it right. Right, right there. Right here. Let's get this right here. Let's cut the vine here. Here's a better view of her. So then the others are going to become ripened because she got kind of big all by herself, wouldn't you say? I would have thought that they all would have grown at the same size, like on some other limbs. But let's relieve the group of her weight and then we'll have this for breakfast. I am encouraging us to utilize God's soil. Look at the beautiful world up there, right? Look through the window. You can see the whole of God's universe being committed to what God says. Amen. That we have dominion and God has been faithful to us to provide for us. Remember, God needs us to take care of his earth. But God also rewards us by giving us fruits from the soil. And I'm encouraging you at home to please begin to grow your own fruits. I'm going to have this for breakfast. I will cut her right here. Amen. On a slant. And that's going to be our breakfast. Continue to eat what you grow. Because God has given us green pastures. And if you want to see how I do it, these are my lights. Right there. Right there. And because of this state that we're in, it's cold outside. So, God is still faithful to us with the soil in a bucket. Look at that. Isn't God great? Here she is. If you would like to know about growing in home, indoors in your home, please subscribe. And then I'll give you more and I'll show you what else I have in my indoor garden.